Good morning, everyone. It is early, <laughs> but we have two more hours to drive, so we're uh, grabbing some breakfast right now, and uh, we're going to leave the hotel, and uh, we're going to drive to Marco. So for now, I'm just going to walk around, see if I can find anything while I'm waiting, and uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys when I see you. Check this out. Got some sort of egg. It looks to be most likely turtle eggs, assuming that we're really close to water, but cool. Not sure what species, but I'm just going to leave those be. Likely slider eggs or soft shell eggs, but that's neat. Check this little guy out. First snake of the trip. It's a little invasive Bromney blind snake. One of the smallest snakes in the world. Crazy. These guys are out here feeding on ants and termites. But, yeah, really cool. Crazy how these things traveled across the world to get here. And now they're just taking root. Neat little animal, though. Alright, guys, so it's been a minute since I've been out this way. So, I think. I'm gonna do a little bit of flipping today. And uh, I'm gonna see if we can't turn something up. I think they just want a curly tail lizard. Guys, check that out. Let's see if I can grab him. Oh, dude! I think that's a striped mud turtle, I think. What? Dude, it's so small. Look at that. He was just chilling out right in this little sort of puddle that made that was made by these ruts. That's so cool, dude. Look at that. So I believe this is a striped mud turtle. I'm not too familiar with my turtle species, especially when they're this small, but that's really cool. You know, dude. I'm just going to grab a couple quick picks and then uh, I'll leave it back to chill out in its puddle. <laughs> Neat though. Alright bud, back you go. <laughs> That's so cool. Ooh, I'm getting eaten alive by bugs, so I'm just going to show you quick, but underneath this palm tree, looks like a ringneck shed, so that's cool. But. I'm just going to leave it be, I'm going to keep moving because I'm getting eaten alive right now. Blind snake number two. This one's a little bit more brown and a tiny bit bigger. I wonder if you'll allow me to grab some photos. Oh, if he doesn't get away. Oh, got him. Cool. Man, these guys stink though. Very cool. Alright, so... Today we're headed out to the glades, hopefully do some hiking and flipping. It's going to be 77 degrees today, so really hoping we can turn up something nice. It's going to be partly cloudy, which is great, so I'm going to hit the road and then uh, we'll make it to the first spot and hopefully we can start searching for some snakes. literally just arrived and just saw a snake fly off the road. I think it was a racer, but it was hard to tell. I didn't really get a good look at it. It was actually on the road right here. I'm not too sure what it was. Could have been an Everglades racer or a water snake. It looked a little bit too slender to be water, so I'm assuming it was a black racer out basking. We are here. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's such a good feeling. Oh my gosh. I mean, this is gorgeous. Look at this place. Well, I'm going to get to it and get out here and I'm going to start looking for snakes. Literally, I've been here. I think literally I just pulled in. And there was a snake right here out basking on the road. God, it feels good to be here. Oh my gosh. It's been a long time coming. Oh, so cool. All right. Well, I'm going to hop in the truck. I'm going to park this over the side and I'm going to do a little bit of hiking 
and then we'll switch over to sort of road cruising to see if we can find anything else. So I guess we'll get to it and we'll see what we can do. Guys, we got snake eggs. Dude, that's so cool. All right, I'm gonna give a quick picture and place this back so I don't squish them, but very, very cool. All right. Go. Found. Buddy, gonna have to move, pal. There you go. <laughs> Those things are so cool. Oh, dude, this habitat is absolutely gorgeous. Now we just need to find some snakes. Check this out, guys. Walk over here. Look at this monster. <laughs> Dude, that thing is huge. Wow, look at that. That is amazing. So cool. Dude, what? <laughs> it's huge. Look at the size of that gator. That thing is massive. <laughs> what? Are you kidding me? That is so cool. Wow. That is an absolute behemoth of an American alligator. That thing it's huge that is sick all right so as of right now the day has been pretty largely unproductive so I'm gonna do a little bit of hiking along this pond here and uh, if we don't see anything then we're gonna head off and uh, move to our next spot oh, ring neck oh dude oh look at Oh my god, that is the most gorgeous ring neck I've ever found in my entire life. Look at you! That thing is bright orange and red. Dude! Nice! On the board at least. Absolute beaut. You can see it's using that tail as a defense mechanism. Showing that bright coloration. Has aposomatic. I don't think there's anything else hiding under here except for that giant millipede sweet look at that first snake of the trip or I guess third snake technically not including those or including those brown snakes or not really but sweet look at you oh, don't get away not yet I want to photograph yeah that's the prettiest ring neck I've ever found gorgeous and it's pooping on me. By far the most gorgeous little ringneck I have ever caught in my life. Look at the colors. Absolutely gorgeous. Bright red to that amazing orange. Super cool. Alright, well, we're going to give it the lease here. Maybe I'm tripping. But I think that's a gate. That's a monster gator. <laughs> Holy crap! The thing was huge! I thought I saw his head poking out. I'm like, nah, what? Well, that's cool and terrifying. Interesting.